What's up Cloud Gamers? Welcome to the Cloud Gaming Extreme channel. So in today's video I'm going to be showcasing GeForce Now running on the smartwatch. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, I said it. GeForce Now is running on the smartwatch. Now this is the Cosbit Prime 2. This is a full Android smartwatch. So what this means is this has a Google Play Store in here to where you can download applications. So I have GeForce Now downloaded. I have Google Stadia, I have xCloud downloaded. And so with that, I can just get right into playing any cloud gaming service I want or platform, if you want to call it that. So today's video though, is going to be showcasing GeForce Now. I'm going to show you guys some games running on here like Cyberpunk and Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Uh, so let's get right into this. This is the menu as you can see. It's pretty fluid when you just flow with your fingers, just like it is with you doing the same on your smartphone or tablet. This is Cyberpunk. Again, just gonna open it and we're gonna get right into some gameplay. The loading time for this is really fast as well. Again, it's utilizing the cloud and it all depends on your internet connection and how well, your device connects to the internet and this device connects pretty well. This is a 2.2 inch display. So the screen is gorgeous and I think it's big enough to handle cloud gaming, especially playing AAA cloud gaming games. So here we have Cyberpunk just running. As you can see, it's very smooth using the Xbox One controller. When you pull the trigger, it's very responsive. You really don't detect any latency and I'll give you guys a test here. So here I'm showcasing latency. So you guys can see there's hardly any. When I pull the trigger, it fires in the game. So again, just want to showcase Cyberpunk for you guys running on this smartwatch in GeForce Now. The Xbox One controller works really well, it's really easy to pair, just like you would normally pair with any smartphone or tablet. So again, as you can see here, we're going to just showcase the latency a little bit. So as I pull the trigger, you're going to notice that it's just as responsive on this smartwatch. This is really brilliant, again, knowing that this game struggled to run on current gen consoles. So next game I want to showcase is Assassin's Creed Valhalla. And again, this is one of those games that just ran smooth on here again. It just blows my mind that we can play AAA games in the smartwatch. This is a gorgeous looking game. This screen, again, like I stated, it's a 2.2 inch screen. So it's big enough to enjoy a little entertainment like gaming and watching movies and YouTube videos. Now let's get into this gameplay and I want you guys to see something because on my smartwatch it actually looks a lot better than it does in this video. My camera was struggling to capture the visuals the way it looked on my smartwatch. So I just want to give you guys a heads up. It actually looks a lot better than what you're seeing right now. But this game runs smooth on here and you're going to see based on the gameplay that I'm showcasing here. This is a good way for you to catch up on gaming easily on your lunch break. If you feel like you have extra time to kill, you can just pull out your smartwatch, just prop it up like this and get some quick gaming sessions in. This runs really well and I was really blown away and shocked by how well this ran. But I feel like some people can benefit by having a smartwatch that cloud games. Alright fellas, just want to showcase this. If you guys like this video, hit the like button, subscribe to this channel, share this video. Appreciate you guys watching. We'll catch you guys in the next one. But before I go, you gotta let me know. Do you guys actually plan on purchasing the smartwatch to cloud game? Do you guys actually see yourself cloud gaming on the smartwatch? I'm curious to know, so let me know in the comments below. Alright fellas, again, appreciate you guys. We'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.